together. We've never we've worked We've known each other for years, but mm -hmm. it's the first chance we've had. So. We've drunk together. <laughs> <laughs> Elaine C. Smith is the perfect Puntilla. It's the story of Puntilla and... Matty. Her man, Matty. She's a friend of the working man when she's drunk. Yes. But when she sobers up, she reverts to... She's the enemy of the she's working man. She's the enemy man. of the working man. So she has two personalities. She has a drunk personality and a sober personality, and they're very, very different. I think Matty's a sort of moral force in it. Well, Matty's also, I mean, he, he can't help himself. Mm. He stirs up a lot of trouble. When Brett wrote this, you know, there was the rise of fascism. Yeah, and, yeah. and we're looking at and that here again. We are. Here we are. For me, the main themes are about power differential. How do we bridge that gap and what lies are in between that? And how is that power differential maintained? And why is there not a revolution? Which is the great pending question of our age, I think. Him and him and Harry are they kritik bir e, eşik yaşanıyor. O da zenginlik ve e, onun e, dağılımı, eşit paylaşımı. It's quite remarkable how little has changed really. No. Um, from the time he was writing about uh, oligarchs and the people who run the world. It's almost impossible to read Puntilla without being really enchanted because it is very, very funny. And it gets right to the very nub of it when it's talking about the responsibilities. Because we always talk about rights but we very rarely talk about the responsibilities of power and uh, and that's really what it addresses. Deniz e, adapte ederken çok önemli e, bir şey yaptı. O da e, ritmi ve mizahı bugüne taşıdı. Murat, I mean, I think he's widely recognised as one of the best directors in Europe at the moment. He finds all the beats in each scene. So every so often he does something and everyone in the room gasps because it's so counterintuitive, it's so interesting. I mean, all theatre for me, whether it's Shakespeare or, or Ibsen or whatever, it should be a good night out. It's got vaudeville, it's got farce, it's got songs, it's funny, it's tender, it's sweet. Three words to describe the production. It's a, a, a sort of modern day parable, I would say. Peer pants funny, bloody terrifying, that's one word. Really exhilarating. A spectre is haunting world. Play for today. Oh, you had thought about that. No, it's written on the thing. All oh, right. No, I'm kidding.